logical reasoning logic in a clock 30 seconds are needed for six strokes at 6 o'clock how many seconds are needed for 10 strokes at 10 o'clock let's draw the strokes there are five gaps the strokes happen in 30 seconds so each gap is 6 seconds long how many gaps can happen in 10 strokes nine gaps how long will it take 9 into 6 seconds which is 54 seconds option number 1 What will be the length of each piece of rope if a rope 72 cm in length is cut into 8 equal pieces? The rope is cut into 8 equal pieces. So each piece is 1/8 of the rope. So each piece is 1/8 of 72 cm which is 9 cm. option number 2 next question total rabbits and peacocks are 18 the sum of their legs is 52 how many more or less are the peacocks than the rabbits let's call peacocks p and rabbits r when we add p plus r we have 18 If there are equal peacocks and rabbits, then there are nine of each. If peacocks are two less than rabbits, then there are eight peacocks and ten rabbits. So legs is equal to eight into two plus ten into four, which is sixteen plus forty, which is fifty-six legs. Hmm. So option number one is cut out. If peacocks are four more than rabbits, then there are eleven peacocks and seven rabbits. So let's try option number two. Legs is equal to eleven into two plus seven into four, which is twenty-two plus twenty-eight, which is fifty. So option number two is out. Let's try option number three. If peacocks are four less than rabbits, then there are seven peacocks and eleven rabbits. Doing the math, we get fifty-eight legs. So that's not going to work too. If peacocks are two more than rabbits, then there are ten peacocks and eight rabbits. So we have fifty-two legs, which is option number four is correct. Let's move on to the next question. For a correct answer, three marks are given, and one mark is deducted for a wrong answer. Tushar got seventy-eight marks in a paper with fifty questions. How many of his answers were correct? Let's mark the correct answer as C and wrong answer as W. Now we know that there are fifty questions, so C plus W is fifty. Let's check the combinations now. If C is forty-two, that is we are checking option one. Then W is eight. So marks is C into three minus W. The marks are forty-two into three minus eight, which is one one eight. So option number one is wrong. The actual marks are much lower. So let's check with option eighteen. If C is eighteen, which is the correct answer, eighteen, then the wrong answers are thirty-two. So we have. Correct into three minus wrong because negative marking of one mark per wrong answer. The marks are eighteen into three minus thirty-two, which is twenty-two. Hmm. So option number four, eighteen, is wrong too. 
Let's check if C is 38, then W is 12, and the math comes out to be 102. Nope. If C is 32, W is 18. Marks comes out to be 78. Perfect. So we have the correct answer as option number 3. Let's move on. Due to shortage, water is supplied to the city once in every 5 days. Water was supplied 2 weeks ago. When will it be supplied again? 2 weeks is 14 days ago. Let's make a list of days and mark some day as today. Let's say 16. Water was supplied 2 weeks ago. So going back 14 days, we come to 2. Date as 2. Now since water is supplied to the city once in every 5 days, the next day after 2 will be 7 and after that will be 12. And after that will be 17. So water will be supplied again tomorrow, which is option number 4. So the point here is you can you have to look at water was supplied 2 weeks ago which is 14 days ago. So whatever the date might be you have to calculate the interval which is 5 days apart. So we have in 2 weeks water will be supplied 3 times and the next time will be always tomorrow for any date. Namita completes half of the work in 4 hours. Amita completes the whole work in half of this time. Wow! It was 6 o'clock in the evening when Amita completed her work. If both have started to work at the same time, when will Namita complete her work? Namita completes half of the work in 4 hours. So, Namita will take 8 hours to finish the work. So, Amita finishes it in 4 hours. So, Amita started at 2 o'clock. So, Namita will finish at 2 plus 8 which is 10 o'clock. Option number 2. Let's move on. The four sentences A, B, C, D are given below. Arrange them in the correct order. Sentence A. Kumar had a nice interview. Sentence B. Kumar applied to a renowned company for a job. Sentence C. The company appointed Kumar on the job. Sentence D. The company called Kumar for an interview. Obviously, you have to first apply for the interview, which is step number one, which is sentence B. Then you have to go for the interview which is sentence D. Then you actually give the interview, sentence A, step number 3. Then you get appointed. Good luck. Step number 4 option, sentence C. So which of these options will fit in that? It's B, D, A, C. Option number 3. And that's it. That's the end of this lesson. If you like our videos, do share them and subscribe to our channel. If you want awesome quizzes, write to us. Keep watching and keep learning with Walnut.